layup by Tony. Here come the Aggies in transition. Spot of three. Got it. In rhythm. Ten point advantage for the Razorbacks. Thought about it. Now the three on the way and knocked down by Rack. Shot clock under ten. Another three. And another make from the wing. It's Rack top of you. Easy one for Williams. Missed it. The follow plus the foul. Henry Coleman. And you know he's playing with a little extra juice. The former Arkansas Razorback. The Hogs are having a hard time scoring inside. No block out by Tony. Coming to you to get it to, to your teammate earlier. Tough shot. Wow. And it's going down. Yeah, now can uh, can Arkansas get some stops? Can they find a way to get back in? Not, not that way. Again. Euro step. All the way down to five on the shot clock and a three point. Another turnover. No take. Blocked again. Texas A&M with several blocks. Uh, Shaq Diesel used to do when he'd catch it with the offhand. That's nice, Tony. A&M needed that one. Makes it more entertaining when it's not a pinpoint pass right there at the rim. You know, and just salute to Tony. There's Taylor for three. Good job again by the freshman who's been the steady hand. Woo, there he is Boy, again. Wade Taylor again. He's going nuts been, right now. Even his teams. Instead, it's been A&M. Likes, a lot of dribbling, and Taylor just ripped it away. This one is mine, and I'm taking it to the rack for two. Tyrese Radford uses the ball fake to perfect. Raced in transition. Boy, the Aggies brilliant around the rim. Taylor for three. Coach Gus Arginal, who tirelessly tracks it. Um, and by the way, I, I but he's gonna have to carry him on and, and that could be to A&M's advantage who goes much deeper on the bench See if fatigues the factor late and there's Taylor that freshman Puts it in A&M ball 45 seconds to go Taylor wants a three that's good Inside that top ten all year long yep. Oops, Radford he's been shooting three of the game the feet then their hands there's a kick, Obasaki. He knocks down a three from the same spot that Radford can time. He's made a great defensive play at that end, at the rim or the backboard. And how about a little bounce pass? Looks like it went right through a defender's legs. Gotta ask. How about the running floater that hits the front of the iron and falls? And that's the way this entire turn. Cash dumps it off. Kick three. Taylor, man, they are knocking down. Not that they ever should be to note they already have any three fouls. Oh, what a tough shot. That goes for Boots Radford. Minutes into the second half. Taylor bumped by Likes. Pulls up. No good. Offensive rebound. Coleman back up and in. A three-point game to get to the championship. And then Key Smart, the legend, said they won this by cash. Hefner, three. Got it. With a win today, they would slot behind Virginia Tech as the number 70, and that rolls in, too. And it's all A&M here in the second half. Oh! Hefner has been a story in the second half as he throws that one down. Miss Hefner, who's dribbling here and taking it with a bounce pass to Coleman, and another on the R's, which I like. I get the alliteration. Inside layup, no good. Tip back up twice, three times, no good. And finally the ball is put back up and in. Terrific work on the offensive glass. 21 and 12. This guy comes in and makes things happen. Transfer from Arizona State. Taylor, wow, ooh, tough, tough motor. Tough shot make alive in the program. And I love that. One of the things that Buzz does with his guys. Pretty behind the back pass. Yeah. Set up a wide open three. Good job by Taylor and Radford. Per year that... They want to stand for the program. One of them is Grace this year as well. Wow. And Davis oh. made a terrific pass to Coleman, who took it all the way the other way for a layup. We have to do a better job clearing it on the defensive end. Yeah, Marty, they're still a and still tracking one offensive, offensive rebound per two minutes play. That's a crazy high number mm. that Arkansas is allowing the Aggies on the glass. Brothers have played terrific to start this thing on Got defense. It. That's a lazy pass, and now three on one. And an easy one for Coleman to put up and in. Ten point lead. Under 15 to go in the second half. Coleman. Tough shot. Boy, that was contested by Mitchell, but Coleman with the left. The team in points and assists. 
find out just how real Bruce Pearl's Tigers are. Yeah, well, their guard play is always a question mark. It's not the question mark for Texas A&M as Radford sticks one. <laughs> Great effort, Marty. Tough alley-oop denied, and here comes an easy one for Radford. Devo Davis has had some costly turnovers in the by the traffic and fires a fastball to Council in the corner. Taylor penetrates, high Arker, and a foul. Coleman will quiet the crowd. Left hand stays it does. where it usually should. They have an open three. Taylor, no good. He'll get it again. He'll shoot it again. And he'll knock it down. Another offensive rebound keeps this game close. State, Marble with the ball fake. The mustache gives it up, and Solomon Washington throws it down. He's a rip driver. Washington can get on the glass. Taylor looking for Coleman. Coleman hadn't scored yet tonight, and now have a chance for three. And there's the problem when the Twins go out. Bradford has been scoreless to this point. And oh, wow. a nifty move will put him at the line. Who needs three-point shots when you can get three-point plays? That's Graham, and he's 6'9". <laughs> uh -oh. Hefner uh -oh. wide open. Got it! Get of games. When they've held the opponent to less than 25 points in the first half with the lead. Now A&M climbing back in with enough. Taylor penetrates with the wow. left. And he's going to the line. With a pivotal moment to close the first half on the Hayden Hefner free. Uh, three, pardon me. Again. And another Messi. Taylor's got 13. And it's stolen away by Wade Taylor. A convoy of Aggies. Here's Radford. One point game. Followed up by what does Arkansas do on their first possession out of the timeout. Big part of it. And it pays off. The There's pause results in a three. Look him. Radford all the way in. No whistle. And it's shoved in by Coleman. A&M up four, 36 seconds. Here's Council now. Finds Mitchell. And an offensive foul on Mitchell with 27 seconds to play. Daniel House. Here's Davis. Blocked. Radford with the block. Fitting, isn't it? And the clock expires on Arkansas A&M off to its best conference start in program history. 11-2 in the SEC, undefeated here at Reed Arena. His playing career ended because of injury, ended up being a GA for his college team. Radford, mid-range, good. Elite defender on the perimeter. And Taylor had to play the first half with two fouls. Teardrop goes. He defenders. So it's tough to choose, but I just would not do contested shots over Dexter Dennis. They're 0 for 2 this half on that. Put back Coleman, and he's the star of the show in the second half for the Aggies in 2014. And if I'm Buzz Williams, I'm drawing something up to go to the rim or a post up. Because How about that? There you go. Because you got a good look. Did the last 245. Taylor slips through somehow. Got it! We got a one possession game. Well, the Aggies have the energy to keep this thing going. We might be on a roller coaster the rest of this one. Taylor, an answer and a flex. Walsh with the ball fake, and it's stripped by Taylor. Aggies have a five on two. Taylor all the way with it left. Taylor gets to the logo. Nobody stopped ball. And AM goes back up with under a minute to play. It's a six point deficit. Radford the lob. What a finish! Solomon Washington. Eight point lead. Council fouled. 